up guys? Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Nerd Block for this month. So this time it came on time, well relatively, still kind of late for Nerd Block, but a lot sooner than it did last time. But I believe the theme is Heroes for Hire, so I assume obviously Heroes for Hire stuff from the Marvel Universe. But let's see what we get out of here. Okay, there seems to be a lot of stuff. We'll start with this shirt. And we'll see what it is. So it looks like Guardians of the Galaxy because it's got the mixtape on it. Of course, it says Awesome Mix Volume 2, which is from Guardians of the Galaxy. And even has a Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 tag on it and everything. But it does say Nerd Block on it right there. So it's kind of weird that it's um, got a Guardians tag on it, but yeah, it says Nerd Block on it. But it's still pretty cool. So that's a cool shirt. I mean, the brown color is kind of weird, but... It's still wearable, at least. That's all that really matters with that. So that is awesome to start out with. Next up, we will go with a Groot of some sort. It says it's a 3D magnet. And so it looks like, a, um, of course, the baby Groot from Guardians 2. And he's holding the mixtape in his hand. So let's see how big this thing is, because it's a pr pretty decent sized box for just a magnet. Let's see. Okay, so yeah, this is pretty big. So, here he is. So, it is a pretty big uh, magnet thing. I sh wouldn't even think this would be a magnet. And it is flat on the bottom, so you could probably just, like, sit it somewhere and just have it kind of like a statue or figure type thing. But, of course, he does have the mixtape in his hand there. And then there are two, like, magnets just attached to the back. That's why I said it's kind of weird, because it's like it's they took a item and just threw magnets on the back of it and made it. A magnet but either way whether you put it on like a refrigerator or something or sit it as a figure it's still really cool and it um, at least by the actual figure it looks a lot better in person than it does on the box because on the box it doesn't look very detailed but in real life it is and stuff so that is cool uh, next up we have uh oh we got a coffee mug I know how I feel with about coffee mugs at least this one is a little bit different. So it is a Deadpool coffee mug. And so as you can see it's like got his eyes and stuff. And then it has two spoons on it that are kind of like his swords. So that's pretty cool. So it's at least it's not just a regular mug. It's something different because of the um, stirring spoons or whatever it says. Oh, oh. We're going to get foam stuff everywhere. How do you get this out? So, of course, here is the mug itself. So, it's pretty cool. It got, like, um, his eyes are, like, coming off of the mug. They're not just painted on or any. Well, they're painted, but they're not just, um, like, you know, painted on flat or anything. They're actually popping off, and, of course, he's doing, like, a weird wink. And then it's got the compartment thing on the back for you to put the spoons in. And then the spoons are down in here. So, of course, here we have the two spoons. And then, of course, they have, like, the um, sword handles on the end of them and stuff. So, you can stick them down in and they're like the sword sticking off of his back so that's really cool i don't know why you would need two spoons obviously two swords but um first a coffee or something you shouldn't need it so that's kind of cool that it is at least something different i mean it's like i just said it's still a mug so it's crappy but it's cool that there's some more stuff added onto it than just a plain old mug and to go with your mug we have more deadpool items and this time they are coasters um, so I assume they're just whatever that logo is, or not the logo, but obviously it's his face, but it's just that. But let's look at what they are. It doesn't say what type of coasters, but obviously we'll find out. I oh, want these come out of here. I think everything so far except the shirt has had styrofoam. Yeah. Okay, okay. So I guess this kind of go, it goes with the mug, actually, because it is a ceramic, like, plate. And so, of course, it has, like, his face um, logo, his, like, Deadpool's logo type thing. And so it's ceramic. So, I mean, the colors, it doesn't match, but it can, like, go with the, like, you have a ceramic mug, a ceramic plate to go with it, or coaster. So it kind of goes all together. So that's kind of cool that they have, like, a combination type thing. Like I said, by the, like, reds and stuff, they don't match, but um, they're still both Deadpool related items that go together so that is awesome and we still have more in here so next up we have a card holder business card holder it says alias investigations and it's got jessica jones on it and so this is by the buckle down company and so i saw that so i assume this was about buckle but 
it is a business card hole. So let's get this out of here. And oh, there we go. Okay, so here is the front of it. Of course, it says Alias Investigations, Jessica Jones, and then Marvel. And then, of course, you just open it up, and there you can put business cards in there. And it looks like it has a business card. If I can pull it out of the thing here. It says, of course, Alias Investigations got the exact same logo, and then it says Hell's Kitchen, New York, um, New York, New York, um, one zero zero three six. So it's got her business card in there too. So that's really cool. I mean, obviously, you don't have any business cards to use this for, um, but that's kind of cool. It's like really nice and stuff. Of course, I've never really seen one in real life, but it seems really nice. It's real heavy. It's very shiny. And you can like re see reflectiveness into it and stuff like that. So that's awesome. And then our last item in the box is our pin for the month. And this is uh, uh, kind of funny. So it's a football with a ribbon around it. And it says laces out. Which um, I know that from, of course, uh, Ace Ventura, um, the movie. Um, I forget what the whole thing is. Ace Ventura, Pet Detective? Yeah, the first one. Or the guy, of course... Um, didn't hold the laces right and then so the loss of the Super Bowl got blamed on him and he turned into the lady detective and stuff like that to get back at like Dan Marino and stuff like that but I loved Ace Ventura and stuff like that and so that's awesome and um at least I hope that's what that is from and not some other thing that I'm I don't know what it's from but we will find out by looking into our book here so let's see what we got in here oh we got some pictures of people that are not me facts about guardians um it says what's inside this month's classic block, and it has a picture of Jessica Jones on there. And so first up we have the Deadpool, uh, so it is a mug, spoon, and coaster set, so they're throwing it all together into one set. Um, so I guess they really do go together. Then we have, I don't know where it went, but it's the group magnet, um, which again I think is really cool. I'm probably going to sit this on my desk or something. Or maybe on this desk or something. I don't know. It's really cool, and I like that a lot. Then we have the keep it away from the monitors with the magnets on it. Yes, we know. Um, then we of course have the business card holder, and once again, it looks like everything in here is an exclusive. Then of course we do have the laces out pin, which does say uh, Mace Ventura Pet Detective, and the, um, so that is what that is from. Then the Guardians of the Galaxy T-shirt, and as I just mentioned, all of them are um, exclusives. And then next month we have Badass Women as the theme. So of course celebrating like the Wonder Woman movie coming out and stuff next month and everything. So hopefully we'll get some cool items out of that. Then we got some Harry Potter things and some Harry Potter related stuff of that. So that's going to be it for this box. What was your favorite item out of this box, bro? Uh, probably the Deadpool coffee mug. Yeah, this is pretty, like I said, it's a lot better than just plain old coffee mug, and we have like a whole set thing that goes together. So that is really cool. Uh, my favorite item will probably be um, the Groot uh, magnet, whatever thing, because um, I think that's really cool. But I think everything in this box was pretty decent, um, and like everything was a high quality type thing. Like this, getting a whole mug set type thing is really cool. Then, of course, we got the alias. Um, business card thing which at least to me looks like a higher quality it's not super cheap this group thing's really cool with all and it's pretty highly detailed and then of course the shirt and the pin and everything or yeah the pin so i think overall it was all pretty good so if you enjoyed please leave a thumbs up leave any comments you have down below and hit that red subscribe button to see more and we'll see you next time